Hi there, Paul here from Keys Letting Centre in Ulverston. So today we're down at 3C View. Uh, this property is just off Church Walk, which is a really, really nice part of Ulverston. Um, Church Walk takes you all the way up to the Ulverston Parish Church. Uh, parts of that building were built in 1500s. A really interesting, uh, really interesting building. Um, but this whole area is, is really attractive. Quite a quiet little uh, residential area, but you are just off the town centre. Um, so 3C View is a four bedroom house, it's got gas central heating, double glazing, uh, there's some on street parking in front of the house there. Um, so we're going to take a look around, uh, if after you've seen it you're interested in applying, uh, just give us a shout. So if you visit our website, uh, keyslettingcentre.co.uk, there's a contact page on there and it's got everyone's details. If you want to get, us, uh, get in touch with us uh, via that page, it'll tell you who to contact for, for, uh, for applying for a property. And then all you've got to do is uh, download the application form, fill it in and get it back to us um, when you can and then we'll be able to reserve the property for you. Um, if you've got any quick questions, you can just comment below. Uh, and obviously, if you think this is relevant to someone that you know, uh, hit the share button and, and put it in front of them as well. Um, so yeah, let's take a look around. We'll see what you think. Right, let's take a look inside then. So you come in here, um, and you've got a small sort of porch, this little vestibule, just by the front door. So obviously it keeps uh, some of the cold out, especially in the winter. So it just keeps that out of the living room. And then once you come in, this is your main living area. There's a bit of space there for a dining table as well. So it's a good size. This is obviously a through lounge, so it goes right the, uh, the full length of the house, uh, aside from the kitchen, which is obviously extended. We've got these really nice bits of woodwork here, so this wood panelling around the windows. Again here. And then the landlord spent, spent uh, a lot of effort trying to get this brickwork, this stonework exposed again, and the woodwork as well. So it's all been really nicely presented. And all this was opened back up again. Really nice. Yeah, this is the log burner. Uh, apologies, no, not a log burner. The uh, the, the gas uh, the gas stove. You've got a French door out the back there. There is a back door from the kitchen, but that's um, obviously letting quite a lot of light in as well. It's kind of functions as a window as well as the door. Some understairs storage there, and this is the door upstairs. I'll look at in just a second. So this is the kitchen. And so in terms of utility space, uh, you've got room there for fridge. And there's more room here for a washing machine. And you could put something else under here as well. It's on three storeys this property, so the first floor has got two bedrooms and the bathroom. So this is one of the, uh, one of the bedrooms. Nice decorative fireplace. It's got a good bit of storage in this room as well. Goes all the way under the stairs. And here's the other bedroom. So this is probably not a double room. I'm sure you could fit a double in, but it wouldn't be a lot of extra room. So perhaps better as a, as a single room or a study. And then interesting here, you've got the um, the internal window. It's a nice bright room this. Obviously we're at the back of the building, but in the late afternoon you will still get um, sunlight through this window. 
so yeah, this just adds to the uh, to the light in the room. So yeah, potential potential study this room just because of how bright it is. And then the bathrooms at the end of this corridor here. So there's a bit of an airing cupboard. Got more storage space here. And the bathroom. This is a vinyl floor. That's an electric shower over the bath. And on the top floor, slightly narrower stairs up. I'm trying to bear that in mind. Got further two bedrooms, both a good size. This is one of them. Again, another decorative fireplace. And this is another bedroom. And then again, this one's got some built in storage. I'll just show you outside as well. It's got a nice rear yard, this is quite sunny. So it's a bit early in the morning yet to show you uh, the full sun. We've got a good bit of sky there. So you get the sun all day, well into the late afternoon, into the evening. And there is a shed here as well. It's a handy bit of storage. The tools, bikes, etc. So thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.